Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we'll be focusing on words. All things related to words. Let's start with advanced words to say about the weather. Is it rainy? No, it's drizzly. Gosh, it's so blustery. It's so windy. It's blistering outside. It's too hot. Is it cold outside? No, it's biting. So now you know why it's called a frost bite. Is it cloudy outside? No, it's overcast. Overcast. All right, we're done with weather. Now let's talk about some short forms which are often confused. First up, eg. Eg means for example. For example, we can name many colors. For example, pink, red, blue, yellow. Next up, ie. It stands for that is. All right, we're done with short forms. Now let's move on to prepositions of time. O and on is used for dates or specific days of the week. AT at is used for a specific time or a holiday period. In, I and in is used for months, years, centuries or other long periods of time. And even millenniums. Moving forward. Aunt and learnt is British. Learned and earned is American. Don't mess them up.